I want to apologize to our fans. 13 penalties. You're not going to win football games in the SEC with 13 penalties. I don't know if I've ever seen two defensive touchdowns come back um, because of penalties. And, um, and, and not just the defensive penalties. I know those are the ones you guys are going to ask about. But offensively, big plays that came back because of receivers blocking downfield when we shouldn't be or linemen downfield or quarterback scrambles on an RPO. And just we got to be – better there and and that starts with me as the head football coach from a penalty standpoint we've been a disciplined group and it's disappointing too because in our team meeting yesterday afternoon um we have a team meeting every friday afternoon where we just talk about situational football and uh and and teams across the country great examples of teams doing what they're supposed to do and great and bad examples of teams not doing what they're supposed to do and that was the the bulk of Yesterday's meeting is is uh, playing clean football and, and not getting into any of the post whistle stuff, which we didn't get into any of the post whistle stuff. I mean, it was a clean game from that standpoint, but uh, way too many self inflicted mistakes and and give LSU credit. It's a great football game. I think the first one with O'Donnell, they said it was what a horse collar on the quarterback. Um, coaches up top told me that they thought he just grabbed the shoulder pad and pulled him down but the referee Jason he's fantastic and he told me that he was absolutely certain that the on the when we hit the quarterback that it was a horse collar so if he said it I'm sure it happened and then the uh whew, the one at the end with Nick um I watched it I mean anytime there's an interception we tell our guys you know find the quarterback and and uh, make sure we get him blocked and it wasn't yeah I mean, it wasn't uh, vicious by any stretch of the imagination, but it's, uh, it's one of those situations. If you're the referee in that situation, it's right in front of you. I mean, I watched it because I looked for the quarterback and I saw it and can't put ourselves in that position.